Thank you, guys. What's up, YouTube, and welcome back, you guys. I'm so excited to do this video for you guys. It is going to be my glam corner DIY. I say corner because it's literally in my bedroom, and me and my boyfriend have two separate sides in our bedroom. Um, of course, we have our bed, but then we have his corner and my corner. My corner, of course, has my vanity all set up, along with this nice background backdrop that I kind of put up today um, this is why we're doing the video but his corner is such a boy corner corner it's filled with all his games his TV um, and a chair and a desk for him to play his video games at it used to be for him to do his homework but it turned into now his gaming system since he's done with school this corner is my corner as you can see it's where I do all my face makeup in the morning before I go to work and it's where I'm going to start doing all my videos for you guys so if you guys are new to my channel thank you for watching please hit that subscribe button don't forget to thumbs up this video and follow me on snapchat Twitter and Instagram if you are one of my subscribers welcome back again this is the DIY so I hope you guys enjoy it all right so the products that I did use um, I ordered curtains from Amazon as well as buying it from Ikea. I bought two curtains from Amazon. It came in a two pack. Um, they are right here. It is called number 918 and it's in the shade of Emily. Literally the shade is called Emily. So um, when I ordered this it came in a two pack so that was great I loved it and it was less than six bucks less than six bucks you guys six bucks so that was a great deal already the white curtain I did get from Ikea um, that one was $9.99 $9.99 at Ikea guys can't go wrong with that and then the curtain rod it's actually a double curtain rod so I was looking specifically for a double one because I didn't want to make too many holes in my wall and the double one holds up to 10 pounds and it's in this weird name um, I'll put the name down below but I definitely can't remember but the curtain is in the name Vivian and it's white and you can't miss it it's in the curtain section with the curtain rod so you won't be able to miss it it's called vivid and it's in pure white it's like a cotton feel for a curtain and then the other things that I did get um, these I did get from Hobby Lobby so these letters were $2.99 each and I actually painted them they actually came in okay so don't make fun of my painting skills guys but they actually came in um, like a cardboard looking color on the back so all I did was paint it with acrylic paint and it came out so pretty you guys and the color that I used in let me put this right back the color that I did use was in the shade light coral and it's Anita's all-purpose acrylic paint that I got from Hobby Lobby and this was like $1.99 $1.99 so I couldn't go wrong with that like I said the letters were $2.99 the paint was to $1.99 and I only went through I don't even think I used yeah, I don't even think I use this whole tube. I think I still have like majority, like three-fourths of the tube left. So the reason why I chose the acrylic paint was because the acrylic paint actually holds way better than the um, water paint or regular, anything water-based paint, it holds better than that. So the reason why I wanted to do this as well was because I wanted something that reflected me. And if you look in my closet, it's a lot of grayscale colors yeah that's me all right black grayscale colors with a little bit of pink that's my closet so why not bring that out into my wardrobe oh and then as you guys can see I for some reason I just left this here I didn't want to move it because it added a nice feature um, this is my diploma that I got at Miramar Community College so I just wanted to add that as well I just kept it in there I didn't want to move it I was like screw it it looks nice it's okay and it's me so the reason why I did a glam corner I did a glam corner because I wanted to basically have this for my background my YouTube background and it's interchangeable so if I get bored of the gray one day and I want to do a blue I'm gonna go buy blue curtains I'm not gonna trip off of it it's 
easier it was easier for me to do curtains rather than the picture frames or the letters or just sprucing it up a different way I like curtains like I said cannot go wrong with curtains so without any further ado let's go ahead and watch the video of how I put the background together right now I need a miracle hurry up now I need a miracle stranded reaching out I call your name but you're not around I say your name but you're not around I need ya I need ya I need you right now yeah, I need you right So that's it. That's my tutorial on how to glam up your glam corner, whether it's just simply by curtains or even anything else you want by picture frames, wall decals, anything you want. You can definitely glam up a little corner like I did on mine. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and comment down below or you guys can reach me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. If you guys have not subscribed already, please subscribe to this channel and give this video a thumbs up. And if you guys have any products you want me to review or anything you want me to try, definitely comment down below. I'm willing to try anything and everything within reason. Within reason. So don't go all crazy on me, all right, guys? Thank you guys so much, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks. Peace.